everyone welcome back to more fabrics i hope you guys are having an amazing november i can't believe it's november already if you're new here don't forget to thumbs up like subscribe i'm uh, presenting you guys the november um i'm gonna call it you know it could be gratefulness thankfulness um kind of kit um it, it's a theme that goes with the fall and you can also use it for i would definitely say you can do floral garden kind of thing if you want to it's pretty universal my main goal was to give you a multitude of ideas, some um, extra unique things that I normally don't put into the kits, and I can't wait to dig in for you. So you're going to have a bunch of fabrics, um, and then a bunch of ephemera, and then uh, lots of tabs here, fabric tabs. So what made me inspired to do this, this kit was my dear friend, Melissa, um, and I'm dedicating this to her because she's been a dear friend of mine since childhood, and we, she's a very good Christian girl. And um, we both grew up Christian kids. I was a pastor's kid. And uh, so we did a lot of missionary work, overseas work. Um, and then we became uh, young adults. Um, then things changed and then we got married and kind of went our separate ways. But she does a lot of prayer journaling, gratitude journaling. And um, she's got the biggest heart of anyone I know. So I was going to create something for her. And this is where it started. So, but as I was creating, um, I ended up just making these packs for you guys. I had plenty to make at least 15 of them. Um, and I hope you guys absolutely love it. So I guess what I can do first is I can dig into the fabrics, go into the ephemera. Uh, but first, I was going to show you the fabric tabs or tags um, that I put in here. As you can see, I, I took it off that. But you can also stitch that down if you want to um, on any any fabrics like for instance when i go i'm going to move this over just a little bit i'll go through all the fabrics to kind of explain to you um, the different you know things you could do i can totally see stitching around here i can see layering maybe some lace um, each one of these fabrics which you have one two three four five six fabric prints what you see is exactly what you're getting each print's going to be 10 and a half by 14 and a half. These packs, guys, are only $28. It's filled. It's crazy large filled. Usually I would say 34 but I really wanted to give you guys a great deal. I had got a great deal on it, and you guys can get blessed as well. But like here, the fabrics, like I said, are 10 and a half by 14 and a half. Plenty to mess with. Ooh, sorry, guys. The camera's kind of like not liking all that print. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hang on one second. Okay, wow, that camera did not like that design. Sorry, guys. Um, but you can use this as a journal cover, or you, again, you can add, take away some more of these tags. I can see using the in-between fabrics, the strips, um, layering things, snippets, and making kind of clusters. But there's like a rose here. There's a lot of things you can cut out yourself. And I have this upside down. I do apologize. There you guys go. Um, so it's absolutely gorgeous. So you get, like I said, you get a cut of this. And I'm just going to start laying it over here. This is my example of what I'm trying to say. So you get, like I said, six, what I count? One, two, three, four, five, six different fabrics here. Like here's this one here. I mean, you can easily sew that on front to make that a junk journal cover. Maybe you do even, if you wanted to, you can do a, a book plate, which the kit comes with one book plate for you guys. Um, you could do a book plate there. So there's that print. And here's the other tags. Look at, I'm just going to lay them on there and I'm going to go through it with each one of them so you guys get ideas. Or this can be the inside of the journal cover of this one. However you guys like it. You know, it's just, there's so many cute ones. I mean, there's so many things you can do. I do it upside down again. I apologize. But just pretty, right? Just absolutely gorgeous. So there's the green. And then you have this here. This, like, a, I would say like a peachy color. Absolutely gorgeous. Again, there's so much you can do. I mean... You can put gratitude there. Wait till you guys see the dictionary page. I, I did, um, I found in the old dictionary, um, two pages that I absolutely loved. And I copied it for you guys onto a, like a coffee dye type paper to where you guys can pick out what you want. And on it, I found thankfulness, which I thought was really, really cool that you can use. And in there too is the definition, thankfulness, if you want the definition in the book plate. And then I found gratitude a gratitude journal i guess i could have looked up the word prayer maybe if i go in the dictionary and find prayer i can put it in there too and there's the definition if you want the definition in the book plate what's cool about this page it also has grace isn't that cool and the definition as well so i put that in there for you guys if you want to use it for this um or use it for a book page you know you got an entire page here that's like coffee dyed for you on the papers 
yeah so I can see you could totally put it on there do as you wish obviously um, but I can kind of show you guys the different you guys kind of get the drift I'll do it quickly this time so I will really want to show you guys the ephemera that I put in this pack um, as well so I'm giving you guys options this is my favorite piece right here look at this oh my gosh this was vintage absolutely gorgeous sorry I guess I could have ironed it um, again what's really cool about it there we go hopefully that works you can do the same thing I just told you you know you can just it's a lot of flowers so I'm not sure if that's what you want to do but anyways kind of neutralizes it with the the beige around it and cream all right guys you guys got the drift of that one and then I got um, an ivory upholstery fabric let's see here And again, you guys, I know you guys absolutely love working with upholstery. So many options, you know, so many things you can do. And these fabric tab tags are just gorgeous, aren't they? Of course, I didn't do the best rip in that one. Anyways, you kind of get the drift here. Put that there. And then you got this one here. It's like a, a green. What's cool about this one too, the inside, look how much bolder that is. Isn't it cool? Sorry guys, my lighting is going back and forth. I gotta figure out my setting for my lighting since I changed my station. I gotta learn it. Take time doing it. Again, look at that. Pretty, right? I totally let my plate go. Can't really tell because I don't have the words in it, so you kind of may not be able to see the face plate in there. I guess maybe I can pretend by putting a stamp. Here you go, I'll put a stamp so you can kind of see. I guess maybe not. Not enough here. Maybe that might help. Anyways, but you guys have ideas. I'm sure you guys are going to come up with something really pretty, but that is a lot of fabric already. That's just in this pack. It's only, like I said, $28. Or is it 24 Oh, Lord. Who knows? <laughs> you guys, you, I would think by now, I when I go and do a video, I should have like an idea of what it costs. Down below, we have the information for you guys and the direct links for you. So again, that's a whole lot of fabric that you guys get. Um, in this pack, which is absolutely cool, and a lot of fabric tabs. Of course, like I said, you get a book plate, which I did like an antique finish to go with the theme. That will go in here. And then in the ephemera pack, I put this really cute, of course, you guys knew, I already put this in there for you guys, is this wallpaper. It was just pretty. I kind of folded it over, and this is what started the theme, I thought of her. What's cool too is if you, that was a book cover, because I could totally see you guys stitching this down on upholstery. Um, I couldn't see why it wouldn't work, right? Um, but I was thinking the book plate would be so cool on this with that backdrop, some way, somehow, with whatever you want on it. Obviously, this would need to be cut, but isn't it gorgeous? Imagine you can you do away with the birdie there. And anyways, you guys have choices. It just, I just love that wallpaper. It was gorgeous. Um, in it, you're going to have all kinds of stuff, guys. I did all kinds of floral pages. You get two of these rose papers. I fold it in half. There's one there. You can find another one. You get a playing card with some birds. This is train a train log. I kind of was playing with it and did like a fold. In your pack, it won't be folded. I was playing with it um, to see if I wanted to... You can you know, for my friend's journal. I figured I was going to do a button or a button there and do like the tie opening and make this a cute little booklet in itself for her. Um, and then you get some inspirational papers. I did a devotionals. Um, there are so many books. I guess I could have brought the books over here to show you, but they were all inspirational and all had beautiful papers. It's just gorgeous. Um, poems and um, yeah. Just vintage papers from, what's that, Steiner Rice lady. Um, just pretty inspirational things. I did some coloring papers. My friend Melissa, she loves the color um, in these kind of papers here. Hope my camera doesn't go crazy on me. She loves to do the, the pencil and the uh, marker type coloring. She just loves those books. So I, I was going to put, I put those in there for you guys too. So really cool. I guess I, at the end, I can just grab those books. Here's another one of those rose pages. I've already kind of like did something here. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a pocket or something, but 
but all are filled with the exact same things you got here. I made sure there's a lot of writing material in there as well. So then you can have, um, I think it's, if I'm mistaken, the listing is 60 pages or 60 pieces. So it'd be pages, pieces. There's that Steiner Rice lady, the poetry um, from her, her books. But all of it's beautiful. I mean, there's a lot of things I wanted to read. I mean, there's just so many, like this one here, um, this happiness is something we create in our mind. It's not something you search for, it's seldom fine. It's just waking up and beginning the day by counting our blessings and kneeling to pray. It's giving up thought. It's that breed discontent at accepting what comes as a gift in heaven sent. It's giving up wishing for things that have not and making the very best of whatever we got. It's knowing that life is determined for us and pursuing that our task with, without fret, fume, or fuss. For it is by completing what God's gift gives us to do that we find real contentment and happiness too. Um, yeah, it's, uh, here's just so many pretty things like this poetry here. Um, is all about, you know, the clouds and just love and everything positive and inspirational. It says here, do not be grieved for the joy of the Lord is your strength. And there's like a, um, a story there, like this one here, um, is what is charm, which is a cute one. That's really cute. It says, he who has known the death shall not again know peace and the calm hearts. Love at thy garden close, and tread the humble ways of men. He shall not speak the common tongue again. Anyways, I can keep going. Um, I don't know. They're just beautiful. I, no matter which page I picked from them, here's another one of those papers from a different book. Um, this one here is from a vintage uh, one as well. It was really cool. I just wanted a lot of uh, be able to, she wants to put her prayers in there, her thoughts. Um, and you guys can do the same too. I got this book, um, which was Billboards of Churches, which I thought was really cool. Each book, each uh, pack has one or two of these. I'm not sure if it was one or two, but it's the coolest things. If those who were in my life the other day, I read some of them. Um, so it was just really cool. Yeah. Those who follow the crowd soon get lost in the crowd. It says we may not have all that we desire, but thank God we don't have all we deserve. It says those who walk with God always reaches their destination. It just has a lot of cool, funny ones, truth. You know, here's another one of those coloring pages. I just kind of folded it in half. Another one of those uh, book inspirational uh, pages. But this one here, I left whole. Um, so my birthday, my friend uh, always sends me cool things. This is cool too. Um, and one of the things she sends me is, um, let me go grab it for you. And I put them in your guys' packs as well. Okay, so the books are by Sarah Ban, uh, Ban, I can't say the last name, but it's gratitude, like journals, gratitude, words. Um, it also has, this one here has like the lined things um, in there as well. This one here has, you can see, it's just all about gratitude. So I put some of those in there for you guys as well um, to give you a piece of that. It's like she gave to me, I'm giving to you guys. Um, at the end of this video, I'm going to show you all the books that I have taken pages from. So you guys can see this one's really cute. Sorry, it's upside down. This one here says, um, this is again from another one of those um, Steiner Rice. I'm sure someone's going to correct me. I'm saying her name wrong. I got to get the book. <laughs> um, another one of her books. I had a few of them. It says, a thankfulness heart. Take nothing for granted. For whom, uh, whenever you do, the joy of enjoying is lessened for you. For you rob your own lives much more than we know when we fail to respond in any way show. But it can keep going. It's just, yeah. It's just beautiful pages, and I wanted to just put them in there as well. More lined paper, more cool poetry. Here's another one of those lined papers. Beautiful poems, guys, I had to share. And then I put in um, a pumpkin napkin to give you guys, it's, as you can see here, we got plenty for those who like to decoupage and do all that cool stuff. And there's, like I said, another one of those billboard things. And I'm sure there's more that goes into this, but I kind of like put it aside because I was messing with it. But my favorite part of all is this. I'll show you. In the pack for you guys, for those who got the, the downloads that I gave away, um, you guys seen that needle book here um, that's in one of the downloads. And so what I did was I provided you guys in this pack. Of course, I'll give you guys that download again for those who didn't get it. Um, I gave you guys, I mean, I'll send you the download. But in it is that... The download you guys will get for this to where you can print it off and have it 
but there's going to be small pages here. I've already messed with them. Here's some leftovers and some stamps and stuff. And these are folded in half. I didn't use these ones, but I messed with it. And I thought I'd sew one together for you guys for an example. But here are from some of the pages um, that are from in the pack. Some, uh, you'll have some of these small rows pages like this, exactly like this. I have two full ones. And we'll have the flowers and stuff. You have the music pages that will be in there. You'll see coming up here is the flower. There we go. This is like a vellum type of coffee dyed. Here's more of the flower pages. I made sure they're the small book pages from this really cool small book I'll show you at the end of the video. So you kind of guys get the drift. See, by giving you two pages, provided you guys a lot of these cute little flower pages. And uh, isn't that cool? It just, it turned out really good. It folds in really nice with the little sleeve here. And I thought that would be a cute little thing to put in a pocket. Like maybe even one of these guys, you guys inside the book, you can create a pocket, put it in there. I don't know, maybe the smaller guy. Or just, you know, a clear thing to put it in or just give it away as a gift. I thought it'd be really cool is if you put an actual stamp that is not, of course, American stamp and send it in a mail to a friend. You know what I mean? Of course, put maybe like a sticker here or something that it could be peeled off and yeah, not ruin this. You know, they got those stickers like that. Or just put this in a sleeve and seal it, a clear sleeve, and then put the stamp on it so then it can't be opened. But I think it'd be a cute little gift or something that you can use. So of course you guys get the faceplate. Let me go grab those books for you guys to see the books that I use pages from. Okay, had plenty. So the little flower pages that I told you about for the little booklets that I put in there, they folded really cute, um, which I started folding them for you guys' packs, came from this here. It's called Plants for Every Season, American Historical Society. It had the most cute, I mean, garden floral pages that it just I had plenty to use from. Um, I used pages from a French dictionary, which I didn't see any in that pack. So I'm sorry, you guys will have some of these in your pack too. I'm going to try to keep them whole. So they're not going to be small pages. I want it to open up like this for you guys' signatures. I'm going to see when I open it up if I'm able to do that. Um, I use Game um, from Pictionary. Pictionary Game um, has the coolest uh, paper to use. Um, I use A Token of Love by a little book by a romance by Barbara Milo. And it has all kinds of really cute pages. Like, look at, come on now. Yeah, so these are ripped, ready to go into packs. It's just, they're beautiful. That came from that book. All right, there's the Helen Steiner Rice. This book here um, is really cool, which this book cover will go into, if you guys seen in the shop, I have the vintage children's kits, um, 100 plus pages, and you get to choose your book cover for only $10 right now. That's a video that's gonna be popping up here uh, within, before this video or after this video. This one, this book cover will be in there. But as you can see, I have all those pages already ripped, ready to go into your guys' packs. This was cool. This was the start of everything. It was the old roses when it comes to, um, it was all about English roses. It was just gorgeous um, for the, the bigger, you know, here we go. See you guys here for the bigger fold roses. So when I fold the paper in half, this would be the front. It just has roses that are just all roses, just all beautiful. So that was in there. Um, this here is called Golden Promises. This book cover would be also up for grabs as well. It is uh, like a, a like a positive poetry kind of thing um, in there. Uh, the Spice of Life. This book cover will be also in the, the Ten Dollar Children's Pack, which is really cool. Um, that that had a, everything positive and inspirational. I didn't see any of those in there, which I'll have to put some in that one. But this one I'm showing you guys the kit is for my friend. <laughs> so that's probably why. Uh, but this book cover is going to be over in those packs. So there's the rose pages. And then um, I found this for 50 cents, this devotional book. It's an inspirational journal. That is where, oh, look how cool is that? That pocket. Now that's inspirational. You guys see that? How cool that is? That is cool. That is a cool pocket. I guess I could probably use that in my friend's kit somehow, some way. Ooh, speaking of which, maybe when I put that in her journal some way, somehow, maybe that way. I don't know. We'll have to figure that one out. But that is a cool pocket. I'll have to put that one in her thing. Um, but yeah, but in it had, if you guys can see here, hopefully my lighting, I'm not even looking at my video to see if my lighting's okay. 
it has like things like today's my I'm grateful for I offer daily in prayer to today's prayer inspirational thoughts to my day a date and time but the whole book was filled with it so it was perfect for your guys's kits I was able to share this one here this level door looks like this uh, some kind of cancer blood cancer awareness gave away these journals I use the pages in it because they're gold lined papers and it had the date to where you put the date and time and stuff I like the papers in it um winds of silver i think i showed one like this but the other one was gold um was those pages like i told you poetry inspirational type things the church sign is called roadside revelations um by brooklyn m woodcrit something would however say your last name but the whole book for those who are in my live the other day seen it um the whole book had a bunch of them like no matter which way you turned the page you got a billboard it was so cool really really cool um you got pages from cheers it is just the positives called lovable livable laughable lines and what it is is that's pretty much it which i didn't see one in the pack but you guys will have these in your pack um they're just all positive positive you know inspirational type things and then this is called 365 day devotional uh, for women um i got these all like i said at the resale shop they all were new and that is that devotional that gave that um purplish look that helped made that kit look really cute so there you guys go the direct link is down below i hope you guys absolutely love this pack i mean it's filled like i said 28 dollars. you can't beat that you have a bunch of stuff ready to do multiple packs i mean kits i mean not multiple journals because if you did those those covers as the tops of your journals i mean that's six right there but if you use the liners in those you got at least three journals ready for you all you have to do is on the inside put maybe a manila envelope or something to make it stiffer but other than that ready to go hope you guys love this pack as much as i do um keep things positive and this is the month which should be every day we should be grateful for those people in our lives for our lives regardless if our lives are total chaos right now which many are and um at least this is something you could do for yourself or for someone else to where you can um think positive you know for here on forth i mean i'm hoping and Praying for good things coming, you know, here on out because it's been a really rough year, guys. The, the really rough four years, I'm sure, for a lot of people. But, um, anyways, enjoy, guys. And this is my November. I would, if you call it a, whatever you want to call it, gratitude, thankfulness. It's totally up to you because this is your pack. Whomever gets it, and it could be whatever you want it to be. For me, it's for my friend, and because um, I'm very grateful for her. So, you guys have a blessed one. Um, until next time, bye.